All right, we will start the meeting. We uh, are still having some technical difficulties and trying to get the uh, applicant on the phone. Uh, in the meantime, Steve, could you call the roll, please? Sure. Robert Heimroll? Here. Zach Rust? Here. Jerry Jones? Here. Joe Clark? Here. Got a quorum. All right, and if everyone would please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs> Any potential conflicts of interest for today's item? Hearing none, move to approval of the minutes for March 13th. Move to approve. A motion and a second. Any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Minutes are approved. Thank you. Our one item for discussion this afternoon is a uh, modification to the previously approved submittal for construction of a new car wash, quick lube, and emissions testing facility at Sheboygan Auto Group. Uh, hoping to get that applicant on the line. Yeah, if you want, I could just go through a little bit of as to why we're back here, if you'd like. Thanks, Steve. Um, so in uh, September of 2022, we had a previously approved this, and basically what they're doing is they're knocking down, demolishing the uh, oil change and the car wash facility, and they're looking to construct just one new building that will house all those, and they also will include that emissions testing, which I think right now is in the Sheboygan Chevy, and I think they get a lot of um, people that come and go out of there, so they're going to put that emissions as part of this. At that time, previously when we approved it, they had two car wash bays. Since that time, they've gotten some budgets and they have now elected to do one car wash. So it's getting a little bit smaller and uh, soon we'll have the architect, his name is Nate Erps, and he can speak to us a little bit about the changes. So I can answer anybody, if anyone has any questions um, regarding the site plan or use at all. I think the last time, the only kind of questions were with kind of the transition of the taller, um, the yeah, the, right, with uh, there's a little transition between the oil change in emissions and the car wash. There's a little transition in height and some of the questions related to how that was finished off and the mechanicals that were on that section of the roof. The the middle section where it changes height is higher, although the lower roof carries through. So there's building on one side, parapet on two sides. And I don't remember what was happening inside there. Uh, if we had asked for something to kind of close that off, roof screening, okay. um, or if they had said there's really nothing back in there, so there's no point screening it. Yeah, because I recall there were no vacuums outside. Right. We eliminated those. Um, yep. Okay. And there's a, we got a roof plan and stuff, so we can have him just kind of touch base on that. There's very little on the roof plan. There's one mechanical unit right. called out over the oil change area. It's my biggest question has to do with any mechanicals for the car wash. If there are vents or hoods or anything that are going to be not screened by a parapet. I'm sorry? Yes, it is. If 
thought it was going to be a quick meeting today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Need to have it on this one. I thought I always had it on this one. There it is. No. Got it? There you go. That's all you got to do, Mike. IT presence. That's the aura. as far as an applicant yet. So this is what Joe was talking about a little bit. You can kind of see the uh, north elevation, which is technically kind of the rear of the building that's facing Washington Avenue. And then it was this transition area in this area as far as what, you know, what types of mechanicals are in this space right here. So this is the uh, east elevation. So this is what you would see as you're heading uh, east along Washington Avenue. Okay. If you go to the roof plan, Steve. Yep. So that center section, the high bay, has parapets on the north and south side that then just wrap a little bit. But you're seeing the inside of that space, the back of the parapets. There's that, that piece at the top um, that's got the revision cloud around it is a roof hatch. Okay. Uh, and then pavers down, I don't remember what the square in the middle was. What, can you zoom in on that, Steve? See the label? For number five, it's labeled to the right. Uh, so yeah, there's a piece of rooftop there mechanical and rooftop equipment. It doesn't look very big. Is this a section you're talking about right here, Joe? That's the roof hatch to get up onto the roof, and then yeah. down in the middle right there is a piece of mechanical equipment, and then over to the bottom left, that guy labeled with five, it's a piece of mechanical equipment. Yeah. But nothing looks like a huge air handling unit. I guess they do have those shown in the elevations. So if you zoom, scroll down to the east elevation, Steve. So we should be able to see those units. Yeah, so it's just that little grayish box in the middle that's sticking up. This one here? Yeah, the, the one you were on first. On the low roof, that's the piece with the pavers from the roof scuttle over to it. This one? Yeah, it's pretty minimal. I just wonder what it will feel like looking at that. You're sort of looking at the inside of a box, sort of a three sided box. And is that strange?
testing. Yep. Do we know if the applicant is calling in, Steve? Yeah, that was my understanding. I guess uh, what I could do real quick is Would if they you, have given up if we weren't able to get them on right away? I emailed them quick. I can oh, okay. see if I have his phone number real quick, and if I can get a hold of him, I will. And then if he hops on, you guys can just continue on, I guess. Sure. Great. Thanks. While we're waiting, were there any other issues or questions people had on this submittal? Thanks. I was just there four hours ago getting <laughs> <laughs> the emissions done. Scoping so this it out? Be a huge improvement. Yeah. A huge improvement. Yeah. The line is unwieldy going into the building right now because you go in right where you get your repairs done for the oh, yeah. yeah. repairs on the right.
Nate, can you hear us now? <laughs> Nate, not sure if you can hear or see me. If you can hear us, can you uh, say hello? Microphone. Nate, can you hear us at all? <laughs> Jinxed us. <laughs> Nate, can you hear us at all? Hello, Nate. Hello, Nate. Test, testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. Any luck, Nate? Can you hear us? Hello, Nate. Can you hear us? Testing one, two, the three. Nate? Can you hear us out there?
Hey, Nate, can you hear us at all? Nate? Different angles in different locations east of the new proposed facility for us. In the site, you have to be like 1,200 feet away in order to catch the edge of the rooftop unit. Uh, so, for, for all intents and purposes, it's screened. Um, as far as rooftop equipment on that low roof or roof mounted equipment, we have a low profile roof hatch. And then we have one rooftop unit. I believe it's just a three and a half ton unit. It's pretty small, just to heat and cool the welfare area, kind of running through the center of the building. Uh, and that's really it for that low roof. So there, there's no uh, rooftop equipment associated with the car wash? Is, is there any equipment associated with the car wash up on the roof, Nate? No, there's no um, roof mounting equipment for the car wash. Okay, any other questions or comments? In case I would entertain a motion. Make a motion to approve as presented. Second. Motion and a second, any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Motion is approved. Sorry for the technical difficulties, Nate. Glad we were able to connect. Um, let him know he can contact me. If you can contact Steve, he will get you follow-up uh, documentation. Okay. Thanks so much. Yep. Bye-bye. Yep. All right. Thanks for uh, doing that and adapting on the fly. Sorry. Sorry about that.
I think that was the only item we had. I mean, it was relatively basically the same. Yeah. It just that it shrunk down to that one. And if they didn't have those units, I think we are good. So okay. great. Uh, and no need to implement our architectural clinic yet. No, no. Okay. Um, definitely it. have a, um, a couple that uh, you know could be some candidates. I can always let you know, but um, no, not yet. And uh, we'll definitely have an uh, agenda for the first meeting in April. I think it's April 10th. Great. And I would entertain a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We are adjourned. Thanks, everyone. Sorry about that, you guys. Thanks. Thanks for your help. When is Easter? April 9th. April 9th. It's always those ones where you wait. Joe, did you want to get your signature this time? Oh, I forget that signature. Yeah, last time. I uh, you just got it. <laughs>